Welcome back to the 2018 FAMU Homecoming Special. I'm Brandon Jones. And I'm Christian Thomas. And yes, Christian, we're out here today at the FAMU Homecoming game against Norfolk State University. I'm super excited. You can see Rattlers all over the stadium. They are excited and ready to support their Rattlers and watch them strike once again. Oh yeah, fans are definitely excited and they're from all over the country. If you're here at FAMU's Homecoming, one thing you have to try is the different food around. Oh yes, it's very special and we have one of our journalists out there ready to tell you more about that. FAMU's Homecoming is the place to be. There are not only great events, but also amazing food. Vendors are everywhere. They start their days early in the morning to be well prepared for the large crowd. Max Family Business starts preparing their food days in advance. It takes, it takes roughly about 25 to 30 hours to get everything ready just to come out here. Although it requires a lot of time and effort, these cooks love selling their food at FAMU's here. Serena King, owner of Serena's Mobile Food Service, says she and her family have been coming to Homecoming to sell their food every year for 20 years. We love fam. We actually love fam. Fam is like, we love fam. And uh, it is very much worth it to drive. We come early, we get a hotel, um, and it's worth it. We see some friends, family, and it's, it's, it's worth it. In addition to the time it takes to prepare, vendors also have to obtain a permit for their stand's location by paying a one-time fee. I'm Shardae Ray with the 2018 Homecoming Special. Taste of a Rattler is known to have some of our favorite foods. And the Rattlers are taking it one bite at a time as students, faculty, and alumni arrive on the set to take a bite of this delicious food. Are you excited to get some of this food today? Yeah, everything was pretty tasty, you know? They had some snow cones back there for me. Life's great right now. All right, are you excited for this homecoming? I love this homecoming. It's my last homecoming, so I've been excited since the first day of school. That's great. Thank you so much. I'm Titi Lyo for your 2018 homecoming special. Rattlers gather here at the Al Lawson Center for FAMU's annual homecoming comedy show. This year, we have alumnus Clayton English and the 85 South Show featuring Carlos Miller and Chico Bean. Hello everyone, I am Michael Moore here at the Homecoming Comedy Show with assistant track and field coach, Coach Johnson. Who are you excited to see tonight? Oh, without a doubt, Chico Bean! What's up guys? I am here at the FAMU Homecoming football game with Joan Basquette and Veronica Jones. What is your favorite part about Homecoming? The entire weekend is my favorite part. I enjoy coming to the game and I especially enjoy meeting and greeting and welcoming back my family, friends that I went to school with that come back with me too. What has been your favorite part about Homecoming so far? I think just the entire experience because I tell people like when you're thinking about family homecoming unless you experience it's really hard to describe it to somebody from the convocation to the games so there's just so many different parts of it there's nothing like it thank you guys for your time I am Western Michael Moore for the 2018 family homecoming Defense, special back to you guys the team is prepared all week for this game and a win would top off homecoming perfectly. That's exactly correct and Desmond Howard is here to tell us exactly how these fans are feeling about these Rattlers. It was about more than football for the attendees at Bragg Memorial Stadium. It was about the experience. Just prior to kickoff, the famed Marching 100 was joined by the alumni band to entertain fans as over 26,000 students, alumni, and community members poured into the stadium to watch the Rattlers take on 
Norfolk State Spartans. The Rattlers went on to take the victory 17 to zero. We're not perfect all the time. We, we mess up, we make mistakes, but these guys go full speed. They, they play for one another, they play for FAMU, and uh, they're starting to really believe that, that we have a chance to be a special team if we just continue to do little things right. And, uh, so a great win. Uh, as always, we'll celebrate it tonight, um, and then we'll come back tomorrow put it to bed. The game started slow, with neither team being able to score until FAMU nailed a 22-yard field goal from Yahia Ali, and the defense was able to step up in key spots. This pride shows itself in the sheer number of fans that attend the games. Brack Stadium was packed of Rattlers old and new, and win or lose, the Rattler spirit will live on forever, and strike, strike, and strike again. I'm Desmond Howard, the 2018 FAMU Homecoming Special. FAMU Homecoming 2018 was an actual movie, Christian. It really was, Brandon. Rattlers were coming on the FAMU campus to experience events going on day after day. And we want to thank you for joining us as we experience this Rattler revival.